India got its independence and did not have its own constitution until 26 January 1950. Republic Day honors the day when the constitution of India came into effect. All the students and colleges across the country are preparing to celebrate this national event on 26 January. Various competitions are also held in schools. Good morning to one and all present here. Here myself Vaishnavi of class 12th be going to speak some word on this occasion. Republic Day is celebrated to remember the historic moment when our nation became an independent republic country. As we all know that India got its independence on 15 August 1947 and the country did not have its own constitution instead India was governed by the laws implemented by British however after many deliberations and amendments a committee headed by Dr B R Ambedkar submitted a draft of the Indian constitution which was adopted on 26 November 1949 and officially came into effect on 26 January 1950 on the same day dr rajendra prasad also began his term as a first president of india and constituent assembly became the parliament of india under provisions of the new constitution ever since independence the main celebration of republic day has been held at the national capital New Delhi at the Rajpath in the presence of president prime minister and other ranking cabinet members as a tribute to india on republic day ceremonial the celebration begins from the gate of raj rashtrapati bhavan followed by resina hill on rajpath pa- past the indian gate is the main attraction on republic day after the ceremonial parade there is a um, presence of various dignities like the president prime minister and other higher government officer at the rajpath the flag hoisting ceremony at the rajpath in the national capital takes place mostly at 8 am which is followed by a republic day speech by the president and the republic day parade Republic Day march is considered to be an eye catching element of the festival that is Indian festival